Hello everyone and welcome back to another ASSL video. This time we've got something a little different for you. It's 6.30 in the morning and I know exactly what you're thinking. You are thinking, oh was that Bunker Mentality he's kitted out and head to toe with? Uh, well yes it is and if you wanted to go and have a look at that the link is in the description. But that's not what you're actually thinking. You're thinking what are you doing? Well if you've seen last week's video you will have seen that Limp Wrist and Big Stick went round Coder in a not so respectable fashion. But now it would be only fitting if I took one very special man with me and went and did the exact same ourselves through Murray. So Scott Lorimer and Michael set a target in the Texas scramble last time. It's time for us to go and destroy it. If you haven't watched that video yet then you can go and check that out first and then come back and see how we get on in our reply. Now I teased it on the way down, I am filming with a very special man today and that very special man has been very highly requested. Many of you will guessed it already. It is of course the man, the myth, the med- oh, It is of course the man, the myth, the legend. The Beefcake! Beef! Great to be back and great to be taking on Team Limpstick once again. I am here at the beautiful Murray Golf Club and of course we are playing a Texas Scramble. If you don't know what that is, that is where we both hit shots, we choose the best one and we go again. We're aiming to beat Scott which was about one over and we're looking for maybe two, three under today. Let's see how it is. The golf's not been great in the warm up holes but we'll get into it. Tricky tee shot here, that's right we're starting here. Fifth hole for us but the first hole overall. Let's see if we can do par four. Let's see what Beefcake's got in the locker. Pure. Well, it, well it good, good start, good start, good start. Yep. Happy. Yep. Okay, the golf so far has been pesh. Beef kick through in the middle. Probably take his anyway. But just for the practice. Right, troops are level with you. The, so far, some of you will know if you've been following that Instagram account that the golf so far this year has been pish and Beefcake has beat me every single time so far this year. Easy game. Five for five. Five for five. Uh, Beefcake and five five titles <laughs> go pretty well together. As you can see he's rocking a little bit of style today. Hoodie well, on is it? Don't know about that, like trying, trying. Beefcake and a hoodie and a gilet, things you love to see. Beefcake has given me the, given me the muscle once again. <laughs> But about 10 15 yards, probably should let you know that it's still winter mats that we are playing. Nothing we can do about that, so get on board with it. Right, here we are. That's the, the man's ball himself. Second shot, we've chosen to go from here. Beefcake, irons, they don't miss the flags. That one has. Alright though, is it? Should come in off the hill a little bit, I hope. Maybe just a wee touchy left. Uh, surprisingly, that's uh, Beefcake playing this whole solo by, the, by himself so far. We are whole side with a little chip, up and down for a par, struggles. The struggles continue. Cool. I mean yep. it's closer but it's still missable. Confidently just step up. Knock this one in. Scott Lorimer, here's how you make a power, my friend. Have a look at the break? Absolutely not. Yeah, step up, confidently make the power. And after having made such a confident power, Beefcake, you just step, step up. Step up and just make the confident power. Nice yeah, and turn easy. around, let's see that big fat boonda on it. Confidently make the power. We nice go, and easy. Yeah, we go one over through one. <laughs> Lovely stuff, boys. Came when it is loon, right? It's cold, it's miserable, start of the season, we're not quite on our game. Normally we just step up and roll those in for fun. Yeah. What we're doing here is we're luring Team Limpstick into a false sense of security. <laughs> they think they're not on their A game, but we are. We only we're have coming A game. back. Hole number two for us, we're now one over, as you love to see. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit of a fun size par four this one. It's what I like to call the fun zone. Beefcake, this is where you go to work. I would say... There's a chancey. 
Ooh, Chansey. Chansey. 300 plus beef. I uh, I love that number. Yeah. Let's let's see what you've got. yourself off your feet. Just a wee bit right. Not right at it. Nah, it's okay, like, but a lot of you'll be thinking, oh, beefy fun zone. He had a driver. Uh, why is Aaron took the three wood? Uh, it's not because I'm big and massive. It's because I'm not sure where the driver's going to go. So I've took the safety club. And I pulled that left also. So don't worry about that, guys. Possibly gone. <laughs> So, probably a good time to mention that obviously we've used Beefcake's drive at this, the first hole. Probably going to use it at the second hole, third hole, fourth hole, fifth hole, and maybe, right, maybe, I'm just saying maybe, we'll use mine by the sixth. Keep it go, keep it interesting, you know? Yeah, that's S what I like to see. Add a little bit of spice Ooh. to the game. Oh, spice. Didn't realise I was doing Chris Yoink the day. Let me add a little bit of spice to that. Honestly, the standards I have to put up with Beefcake, oh Aaron, I'm not too happy about that one. Uh, he's like a yard off the green. Yes, but I'm not on the green, am I? Just the standards of this man. Up and down over here, we'll, we'll bring that bogey back. Yep. I like the lob wedge here, brother. I like the lob wedge. Good play, commit to it, brother. Good swing, good swing. Yeah, can you, while we watch that roll towards whole side, can you talk us through the double gloves today? Do you think that adds extra grip, extra power? It's extra warmth. Two. That's all that I'm worried about today because it's very chilly. Thanks, Tommy Two Club. Back to you in the studio. <laughs> I've got the wedge. Plenty of room inside the big man. That needs to... Go. Roll. Go. Go. Set. Keep going. Go. Nice. 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 I've seen the miss from there. So, uh, We've shown you so many times before, guys. You don't miss these. You don't miss these, as we've proved time and time again. We'll just knock this in for the birdie. It's as simple as that, guy. It really is as simple as that. You just step up to it and you knock it in for the birdie. You want to have a go, Beef? Because just I practice by missing that. As you've just seen, Beef, you don't miss these, so don't worry about it. Oh, he's not happy. Yeah, bend and do and get the bend in. I see what you're doing. Show him what mama gave you. Yes, good, good Pat. A, a good start. We are, we're still one over. Hmm. Yes. Do you think the two gloves will be hindered the there? The chancy gone. Yeah, chances. Yes, what you've seen at the start is us saying that probably two or three under was what we're aiming for the day. Right now, I couldn't care what we shoot. As long as we're just about level par, I'll be happy. Do you think it's the hoodie? Possibly, possibly. I've tried to be down with the kids and I'm struggling. No, you're playing like a nine year old kid. Yeah, yeah. Right, okay, we move on. Hole number three, another par four, beefcake. You think we could uh, maybe start playing golf? Well, this is going to be a tricky hole, so we're going to need to play some good golf. I think just to get a par, to be honest. Good, that's what I like yeah. to hear the confidence. Into the wind, long par four. But that's what this hooded assassin's here for. I never know if you're happy or eh. That's quite long, let's keep it about the golf. Hold on. Sandy Grave. Yep, bit cold for the beach, but each their own. Get the fucking spade, dude. Yeah, so Troop's new goal. <laughs> the score, not interested anymore. It's just literally to take one of my shots at any point. That would do, that would do us. Because right now, beef kick back. Pretty sore. It's getting, Pretty. it's getting sore. Michael Baber, can you see us now? 55 titles, lol. Let's get one thing and one thing straight for the viewers here. We could have took my ball beef kick, but we've chosen to take your three for three right now. Three for go three. Go on, look, look, go look me in the eye and tell me you're not smug about that. It's just what I do. I want to hit eight iron. The bear has said seven. If this goes long, it's on his head. What, the golf ball? That's a bit harsh, isn't it? Yep, and the iron. <laughs> It's like 155, isn't it a stiff breeze? 55? I, I really hope that is all over it. Short, short, short. <laughs> Look me in the eye and tell me you want to hit 8 iron I now. I just took a bit off that, the 8 iron was a I... yeah, So after that I'm going to hit the 8 iron. No, obviously this is not the 8 iron. <laughs> Where are you going, Beef? Where are you going? Don't play 
like golf, don't make a channel, it only exposes you for being to you. It is lovely to see Beefcake out here this morning, just basically filming him. Don't worry about me, I've got nothing to do with this. One over for your Texas so far, Beefcake. You're doing well in that one man Texas. Right, okay, you join us here at what clearly is Beefcake's shot once again. Birdie chances. Yep, I said we'd take par from the tee. So just, just go knock it in. As chance. you know, we confidently roll these in on the channel. Yep. Right, I hate I hate to make assumptions, but I think you've secured the par. <laughs> wow, the way the putting's going, I'm not so sure. Come down. Yeah. Yeah. So guys, I know you'll be wondering what is that you've just done? That's a par. Thanks very much guys, thanks for coming. Uh, that is us concluded the third hole. That's halfway point. We have a par three still to come. But, I'm um, not gonna lie, I came down here with uh, only confidence we were going to hammer their score. We're exactly the same at the moment and we need to pull the finger out. But, Beefcake, I think the team together. Patience is the key here. Patience? We, oh, yeah. We're a little unlucky, we should be level par I would say, we're one over. If we can get back to level maybe into the red, then I think we've, we'll do enough. Beautiful. I think. Three holes left, we need a birdie. And we need it quick. I think we get this back to level and then we'll let's see what happens from there. Par 3, let's do it. You've just roasted the shank. Yes, I have. I've had enough of taking my tee shot, so we're going to give this one to Aaron. If we end up taking your tee shot here, something's going really wrong. That's right, that's it. Be good. I think it needs to sit. Looks good. We do have a birdie putt here, it's back to level par. Let's go, come on. Keep coming, the hole, baby. keep coming. Yes! Oh, it. Big stick, limp wrist, there's your dinner. You thought he was dead, but he's back. Oh, I've just spat everywhere, COVID. Sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry, oh, I'm sorry, don't hurt me, sorry. Boys and girls, we're back, a birdie at the par three. Fifth hole coming up, now fun side par four. Yep. It's time to go low. <laughs> Here, I'm not quite sure you swung hard enough at that. Told me two gloves. No. Not too good. No. Not happy? Bunker. Oh, mentality, big shout out to the sponsors, thanks very much. <laughs> right, I'm all fired up. For a snap out. Hook. And he's back! I'm back, ladies and I'm gentlemen. I'm not sure who was there on the last, it wasn't the bear, but the bear <laughs> is back. Yes, he's back. Like, it's a tough chance. Surprisingly enough, we've chosen to take Beefcake's drive because I snap hooked one left. Let's have you from the bunker. To be a bit cold for the beach, is it nay? <laughs> yes, beautiful strike loon. That, that other angle will look perfect yeah. for it as well. Yeah, you'll get that driving right Lovely. into the band. So I've kind of let the team down there a little bit by putting it into the face of the bunker. But uh, this is where, when you need the bear, he provides the goods. Oh, I and I th think he has get going. Go, go, down the hill. Get tickled. down the hill. Tickled. Oh no, it's not tickled enough. Take it though. Slightly better than that big massive hole you've left in the face. A little bit. Yes, uh, so you join us here. I managed to get out of the bunker, unlike Sam. <laughs> we'll not name any names, Beefcake. Uh, another outside chance, but you know what we do with these? We just step up and we tap them in. Hold high. Get oh, there. that's get very. Get there. <laughs> cool. Yeah, we just step up and we tap those in. So uh, I feel like Beefcake's not done enough putting today, so. Set, 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 set. Do you know what they are? Two very missable putts. Just never move. Just tapping in. As we've done so very well. I'll cry if we go down the last Nina Birdie to beat them. Yeah, it's <laughs> never anywhere else. 
Now the last time you'll have seen these two young men in a beautiful combination was the Christmas special uh, and we were three under through three. It's not been as scintillating golf this time but we are doing what we can just and no more. We go into the last hole, signature hole at Murray, level par. No calamities when we take this one home big boy. Yeah, I think we can even push for maybe one under, but you we'll want? take level. Right, Beefcake, you beautiful bloke. It's a par for the win. Par for the win. Easier said than done. Par up the signature hole here at Murray Golf Club. Yeah, drive away, I think that's us laughing. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, I'm going to assume that's not in play. That's right down the middle. I don't know which side of the fairway that's on. Oh, I love that arrogance slash confidence, you hooded hoodlum. I was a little sad to hear the comments from the bear there that the lack of confidence in Beefcake after strafing one right down the middle, but I'd say there's room for a better drive. Let's see what he's got in the locker. And that will be another one of my tee shots. I think all we've discovered is I can't hit a driver. <laughs> we'll sign this video off by asking you to get down in those comments telling us which drive would you have taken here? Would you have taken this one right there? Or if we look another, I don't know, maybe 100 yards up the fairway? There's that young man's there. Yeah, let us know, let us know. Oh, that was a struggle to get here. Um, that's right, you heard from the tee, Aaron saying, oh, that's definitely not in play, that ball. And I think, I think, think that's, uh, that's an overstatement of what I said. 60 yards left. Lovely view though, nothing worse than par. We've got like 70 yards here for a birdie. That looks good. Oh. If you'd maybe give it like 15 yards more. It's short. Yes it is. There's no, I'll tell you what that is, that's three putt territory rubbish, you put that rubbish. in. Rubbish, Getting heckled from the, the, ma the not mass crowds, just a, a small crowd. Socially distance of course. Socially distance of course. Oh, that's not even there. <laughs> Thank you. Just when you think nothing could go wrong, everything goes wrong. Yeah, this it's is a long two pack. Yeah, the arsehole has fallen to the back of us. It's now tester territory. I've only done this for that scenic panoramic view up to that beautiful club post. Yeah, that's what I've done it for. Oh, we come here, a nice early morning. Who's this young man up here? Let's go and get a closer look. Oh, oh. It's the man himself, Captain Cuddly, doing his January Paint. calendar poses. Paint Cake. beautifully. Caked in a white liquid. You'd love to see it, folks. Looking gorgeous though, aren't you? Long I'm going to go behind the hole. I think par's good. <laughs> par's what we need, so par's what we'll take after leaving ourselves about 30 yards. Best of luck, my friend. I'll catch you at the other side. I am nervous here. We need a par, two putts. Set, 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 set. Oh no, Aww. set. It's a little bit strong, bud. I've uh, slightly overdone it, but we have a bear who's known for the short game. Hearing that's it happened, Bar, so we're just going to pick that one up and yeah, uh, we we'll, cla so we'll claim victory. As you've seen so far in this video, we've been deadly from that range. Yeah. I think that's uh, pretty much given. So I think Scott's just texted me, he said, That's a gimme, thanks very much. Yeah, nice to win. No, we'll obviously tap that one in. One of us needs to hold this little tap in. Let's just hope Aaron does because I, I don't perform well on the greens at the best of times, far less under pressure. Never anywhere else. And on that note, guys, if you've enjoyed this different style of video, that Texas where we went level par, you know what to do. You hit that like button, you ring that notification bell, and of course, you subscribe. Until next time, we'll see you then.